Hi everyone, Radhe Radhe. In this verse, we're going to be doing chapter 6, verse 40 in this video, I mean. Um, the, here, Bhagwan starts talking again. He responds to Arjun's questions. So, let's dive in and let's sing the verse together. Shri Bhagwan Vacha Path Neva Veha Namutra Vinashastasya Vedyate Nahi Kalyana Krit Karshchid Durgatim Tata Gachati. Okay, the translation is God said, Bhagwan said, Son O son of Pratha, Partha he calls him here, Partha. Uh, a transcendentalist engaged in auspicious activities does not meet with destruction either in this world or in the spiritual world. One who does good, my friend, is never overcome by evil. So Tat here, he's used two, two words here to affectionately address him, Parth and Tat. Tat or sorry, Tat here. Tat is uh, um, my friend, or it's also referred to, according to Swami Mukundanan, that uh, son is referred to. Um, so the son is affectionately addressed in Tat, and the guru is like a father, a father to his disciples. So the guru sometimes affectionately addresses his disciple as Tat. So uh, he's basically saying, Bhagwan Shri Krishna, that uh, God takes care of those who tread on his path. So what he's saying, the translation is, O uh, son of Pratha, the transcendentalist engaged in auspicious activities does not meet with destruction either in this world or in the spiritual world. One who does good, my friend, is never overcome by evil. So anyone who is engaged in auspicious activities does not meet with destruction. So let's go word by word. Never a uh, na eva. So Partha, of course, Partha, never, na, ever, never it is, iha in this material world, here, na, ever, amutra, nor in the next life. So neither in this material world, nor in the next life, vinasha is their destruction, his destruction, tasya, his destruction exists. No, neither in this life, nor in the next life, does his destruction exist. No, never, certainly, uh, one who is engaged in auspicious activities, kalyanakrit. Kalyan is good and Krit is activities. Kashchit, anyone. Durgatim, degradation, my friend, goes Gachati. So, never does one who is engaged in auspicious activities, Kalyan Krit, one who does good, never does that anybody go does to degradation, my friend. Go to degradation. Gachati goes to degradation. So, let's read this one here. Uh, Shri Bhagwan said, O Parth, one who engages on the spiritual path does not meet with destruction either in this world or the world to come. My dear friend, one who strives for God realization is never come overcome by evil. Okay, so he's saying one who strives for God. Kalyan Krit, here is one who strives for God, one who's engaged in auspicious activities, but also one who's striving. So that this one is a little bit more merciful. Like we just, <laughs> even if we're not managing to engage in the way we want to, if we're striving for it, we'll never be overcome by evil. Um, okay, so... Here, uh, it's a long uh, commentary, but he basically divides the people who are following the path to three sections. You can read it uh, further. Um, so, yeah, I'll, I'll leave this uh, verse here and you can read more details if you want to for this particular verse. Okay, we shall do chapter 6, verse 41 in the next video. Wish you a day filled with spiritual growth. Radhe Radhe.